first started off, you know, Festival Model was always very Malaysian inspired in regards to our design in terms of our focus as well. As you know, we want to sort of grow the brand and sort of, uh, you know, the main thing we, we always sort of ask ourselves, you know, how do we make ourselves applicable to the international crowd? So I guess one of the main things is that, you know, that sort of defined really the, the theme of the collection for 2015 and moving onwards uh, from there. Uh, for 2015, you know, Crossing Borders itself, you know, we wanted to tap into other different things like lifestyles, not only of Malaysians, but of our neighbouring countries. And at the same point of time, you know, trying to breach outside of Southeast Asia itself, you know, we wanted to sort of uh, include certain iconic things that people would be able to see and go like, hey, okay, you know, I, I can relate to that or I've seen that or I've experienced that. Because, you know, when it comes down to our clothing, it's all about experiences and it's all about conversational started so the whole thing uh, you know we want our clothes to uh, to really sort of uh, speak who we are and what we really want to achieve so I sort of found out about gender four years ago and um, you know to, when when I sort of looked at agenda as a whole you know it was always like showcasing all the coolest things uh, all the most talented uh, clothing designers or clothing brands were, were, were sort of uh, taking part within the show so you know it's always been a, a dream of mine as well as all of us you know to be a part of it and I think uh, fast forward five years you know I'm working on a collection extremely hard and uh, we said okay you know I think we're much more ready for it uh, we've got a very extensive collection I mean we only started off with t-shirts but now we do everything from head to toe from headwear down to socks so we said okay you know I think we're ready at the same point of time our subject matters of our t-shirts or our clothing is I feel that it's a lot more appealing to the international crowd. So we said, okay, let's let's try this out. And uh, we took that plunge, and here we are, one week away from Agenda. Festival Moda will be showcasing our Spring Summer 2016. We are six months away from that collection, and uh, we're going to be showcasing it at Agenda. I've only been to Agenda once, and uh, just from my sort of observation, there are no brands out there representing Southeast Asia. For us being, in a way, I guess you could say pioneers or leading the way, the main thing for us is to sort of pave the way for other brands to sort of follow after. It's always been a dream of ours and, you know, it's finally coming to life. And uh, we, we hope to see many of our other friends as well, you know, at Agenda down the track. And I guess, you know, for us, what we also want to sort of uh, show is that it's very much possible. You know, even though we're a good 20 plus hours away from America, it's very possible uh, to sort of be a part of it. And uh, I guess for us, that's one of the main things that we want to sort of show here. The main thing that we want to achieve uh, from this trip is of course, you know, to, to get uh, international attention. Uh, you know, we hope to open accounts in America um, and, and really sort of share what what our clothes, you know, that's the main thing. So, able to sort of share our clothes and idealism as well, and uh, our lifestyle, you know, to the international community. And, uh, yeah, that's that's something I believe that we all are extremely unique, and uh, something that they're not, you know, used to seeing. So that would be actually uh, that would be really really cool.